Hi, my name is Matt, I'm with Intertalk Critical Information Systems, and today I'm going to be demonstrating a number of different emergency phones integrated into the Intertalk Dispatch Console system. So, here in front of you on this screen, we have an Intertalk Dispatch Console. Uh, it is a radio and telephone console with a telephone dialer on the screen, some audio controls, um, and a couple of radio resources there just for posterity. Uh, on the desk next to me, we have a number of different emergency phones made by a number of different manufacturers, and I'm going to demonstrate each one of them calling into the Intertalk console. So to start off, we have uh, a model from MCOM right here. It's got some nice capacitive touch buttons on it. So to initiate a call, you simply have to just touch the big red button. You can hear it dialing, and you can see a call at the console. You can answer that call by pressing the space bar, at which time the call is established. And you can hang up then also by pressing the minus button on the keypad, or pressing the release button on the dialer. Um, those are a couple easy ways to hang up a call. Next, we have another model by MCOM here. This one has a handset on it, so if we take that one off hook, uh, just simply dial zero. We now have a call ringing into the console system. You can see this one here. Uh, we had set the caller ID for that one as ePhone 6. Uh, the caller ID for each one of these is configured, so if there's a way you'd like to see the caller ID, for instance, identifying different locations where the phones are placed, that is easily configurable. Um, the call shows up in the incoming call window here. Uh, and then it can easily be answered by either uh, tapping on the icon on a touch screen or clicking on it with a mouse or by pressing the space bar on your keyboard. So I'm going to click on it this time. When the call is answered, it appears in the dialer window here, indicating the time that the call was received, um, the phone line that it came in on, and as well the caller ID of the phone itself. So once that call is active, uh, it can be uh, placed on hold. If you need to put it on hold, pick it up from hold. You could transfer it over to another console position. Uh, or you could patch it across to a radio if need be. Okay, so I'm going to hang up that call now. Uh, so next we have two models of ePhone here by Talkaphone. So uh, similar operation, so if I just press the big red button on this one, uh, you can see a call uh, shows up in the incoming call window here at the console. Um, it is identified, that one's just called InterTalk Talk. Um, so I can Again, answer that phone by sim simply clicking on the entry in the incoming call queue. And once again, we have two-way audio established. You can see my audio is being picked up by the microphone, both on the console system as well as the microphone on the talk phone And we have the VU meter bouncing around accordingly. So I'm going to hang that one up now. Over here, we have another model by uh, talk phone So if I take that off hook and hit the emergency button, uh, we have a call ringing into the console system here in the VoIP 500 ECK. So similarly, I can click on that entry, answer the call, and have two-way audio. Uh, and then moving further down the desk here, we have a couple models by Gaiatronics. So in this first one here, um, this is in a ruggedized yellow box. So if I take that one off hook, simply dial zero and press the call button. And uh, wait a moment. You see the call show up in the incoming call window here at the Intercom console. So similarly, you can answer the call, two-way audio is established, and then hang up the call. Real easy. And then last but, last but not least, we have another model here by Gaiatronics. And similar to the other ones, you can call in by pressing the, the big red emergency button. So we press that, we see a call here in the incoming call window. And once again, I can just answer that call by clicking on the entry. I have two-way audio established and then I can hang up the call when I'm done. So I talked briefly about our incoming call queue here. So um, that supports as many calls as are coming into the system. So you can see a view of about seven or eight calls and then that expands into a scrollable window. So if you get really busy and you have a lot of unanswered calls, they, they can continue, continue to fill that window. So for our final demonstration here, we'll show what it looks like when you have calls being received from multiple phones. So I'm simply going to walk through here and just start uh, pressing a lot of buttons. So we'll place another call on this one. The other Gaitronics one here. Uh, this Talkaphone. This other Talkaphone. Our MCOM. And our other MCOM. So you can see here we have calls from all six phones concurrently ringing into the console. You can see the caller ID for each, the time at which each call was received, and the phone line it was received on. In this case, they're all coming into the line, identified as emergency phones. Um, the priority that the calls ring in at at the console is configurable. 
um, you can have normal priority or you can have emergency phones or you can have um, important calls. You can change the color that they show up in the queue um, as well as the ringtone associated with each. You can answer multiple calls. Answering each call puts the subsequent call uh, on hold. So you can have multiple calls up and have other folks on hold. So if you need to answer the calls and then just simply park them so that you can get to them later, you can do that as well. You can create a patch very quickly and easily and patch a phone across to a radio. Um, I'll give a quick example of that. So you can add a call to a patch and add a radio or a couple radios into that patch, piece of cake. And when you're done with that patch, you can simply release it. The call is still there, but on hold. And then you can simply pick up calls from hold and hang up those calls um, as needed. So those are some of the features of the Intertalk console, um, specifically demonstrated with a number of different e-phones made by a number of different manufacturers. Thanks for watching.